In this video, I am going to explain a practice problem which is based on ketoenol tautomerism. This is carbonyl compound which contain two alpha carbons and left hand side alpha carbons has two alpha hydrogens and right hand side has one alpha hydrogen. We know alpha hydrogen takes part in ketoenol tautomerism. When left hand side alpha hydrogen takes part in ketoenol tautomerism, we get compound A. And when right hand side alpha hydrogen participate in ketoenol tautomerism, we get compound B. Now there are two types of enol is forming. We have to check which one is more stable. Compound B is a more substituted alkene. This is alpha carbon and this alpha carbon has three alpha hydrogens that means three hyperconjugation structures are possible. In compound A this is a less substituted alkene. There is no alpha carbon, no alpha hydrogens that means no hyperconjugation structure. We know that more hyperconjugation structures mean more stability. That means compound B is more stable than compound A.